Hello everyone, my name is George Garcia. I'm a product support specialist for Autodesk Eagle. And in this video, I want to show you a quick, handy way to change grids in your design. So, as we're all aware, Eagle supports both a standard grid and an alternative grid that's defined using the grid command. As we can see here, we have the standard grid and the alternative grid. Now, what many are not aware of is that you can have several default grids. So, for example, if we right click here on the grid icon, it'll open up a small menu. It says last and new. So I click on new and I can give a name for this alias and I'll call it metric. Okay, and now I'll go ahead and change the grid to mills. Okay, let's make this one 12.5 for example. I'll say okay. And now I can go again here new again and say imperial and what this allows us to do especially when you when you have mixed uh, surface mount and through hole usually through hole parts tend to be on an imperial grid 0.1 or some fraction of 0.1 inches whereas surface mount components tend to be on metric grids so you know if you're moving some of your some of your of your through hole parts you could use the imperial grid and then whenever you want to rearrange your metric parts you just right click pick metric and there you go you're back on the metric grid right click imperial and we're back to imperial so very handy feature we know many users have several different custom grids and this is something that can really help speed up your workflow thank you very much and have a great day